G'day YouTube. This video will show you guys how to install the popular music streaming app named Spotify on Linux Mint 17. Now there is a couple of extra steps to do with this as opposed to some other software installations. You do have to add the repository for this popular software in order to get it going. So there's four steps in total, so we'll get into them now. So first of all, starting off, step one, well, open up a terminal, then let's do step one. So let's enter the first command. Now all these commands I will post in the description below, so no need to sort of type them out as I type them. But uh, let's start off by doing the first one. So we need to add the Spotify repository signing key to be able to verify the download packages. So that is, here we go, so this one here, so this spot, uh, sudo aptkey adv key server. So step one, throw that in, hit enter, and let that be done. Okay, great. Step two is add the Spotify repository. So let's do that. Now I've previously typed these in, of course, so it's the echo deb repository. So that's step two. Same again, just hit enter. And there we go, that's done. Now, step three and step four, a little bit easier. Just type in sudo apt update, so as to update the repositories. Now, this might take a few seconds, but after it's done, we need to just do the final step, which is step four, to actually install the software itself. So let's just give this just a hot second and it should be done. There we go. Okay, so the next command will be just sudo apt install Spotify client, which is also in the description below the video. So let's just see if we can get that going. Now, of course, mine's already installed, but I'm um, just uh, showing you guys quickly through the process. And let's see, so that would be final step four, sudo apt install Spotify-client. Now I'll just do a dash yes, so as to speed up the installation. Uh, sometimes it will ask you for your password, maybe not, I've already done it on mine, so that's fine. And then there we go, Spotify client is already the newest version. From that point, of course, just go to your start menu, have a look for Spotify, and you should be able to find it there. Whoop. Spotify, and there we go, click on that. And from that point, it will get you to sign into your Spotify account. If you don't have one, it allows you to sign up. And uh, stream away, stream music away, guys. So that's pretty much it in a nutshell, guys. Hope this has helped. Hope this has been of some, yeah, informative help for you. Cheers, guys. Hope you've enjoyed.